Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I am going to do a regular plan with me in my Erin Condren Vertical Colorful, and I'm going to be using the Back to School 2.0 kit from Sweet Kawhi Design. So, I am not going back to school. I do not have kids that are going to school, but I work in the school. I'm not a teacher, but I am an occupational therapist, and back to school time to me means back to work time, and I'm no longer on summer break. So we've actually been back in in-services all this week, but this week is going to be like our first week with kids going back to classes. So I love these pencil checklists. They are amazing. This color scheme is also really pretty for back to school. Page two is going to have your full boxes. These are what I would consider functional because you can write in them and they're gonna look really cool with it being like paper. Uh, you've got some typography and then some deco. Page three has a few more full boxes as well as a weekly schedule, habit trackers, um, like load lunch cards, school supplies, prep outfits, and that little bookworm, as well as dinner utensil banners, and then some TV banners. Page four has these really cool functional half boxes, and then you've got some quarter boxes. The bottom washi is so freaking cute. It's a ruler, and then the date covers are the little bookworms. I'm really excited to use this kit, and I am just going to dive right in. Oh, let me update you guys on some things. Sorry, my phone is going off too, and we have like flies buzzing around. Okay, sorry, let me turn that down. The flies are driving me nuts. It's the sound that flies make that drive me crazy. But let me get going, and I will chat with you guys. Okay, so today is actually Wednesday of the week prior, and I never, I never like plan this far in advance and I know it's really like not that far in advance but it it actually is so usually I film my plan with me's on what well, was kind of like Friday ish during the summer because I had Fridays off but sometimes Saturday mornings I would get up and plan to like do these plan with me's um so yeah it's Wednesday night and I haven't done it this early in a really long time which feels weird because I just don't feel quite prepared to know what my plans are for next week yet, but we're gonna make a do with it. I'm not doing so hot laying them down straight so far. Is it gonna be one of those videos? I hope not. But anyway, I went back to work on Monday. We had a back to school in service for my company. So my company actually services eight different school districts and I'm like kind of got a home base in one of them. So yesterday, actually I didn't technically have to work, but I went ahead and asked my CODA to come in and work a half day with me because we just have a lot to get ready before school starts. Just so we don't feel so like completely just bogged down once kids start showing up next week. But we ended up just working the half day yesterday, like I said. And then today, so today's Wednesday, the my home base school, their teachers were actually uh, set to come back today. So they had like their start of the back to school in service kind of stuff. But I didn't sit through it. I'm not employed by the school itself, they're just like gracious enough to let me have a little space in that building where I can house all of my supplies and materials and it's, I will forever be grateful that they allow me to do that and I, like it's so hard to explain like how grateful I am that I do have a place to work because the first, actually like the first few years of me working for this company and in these schools, I didn't have a place. I had everything at home in my guest bedroom, or actually the first year we, we lived up here, we were actually in a little one bedroom apartment. So to keep everything there or in my car, and that's just really, really hard and taxing. So I am so grateful 
that they allow me to have a little space in one of the rooms. But it was super nice to be able to see some of my coworkers again today. But holy goodness, I am exhausted. I'm almost more exhausted when I have to sit and either talk, like talk teach to someone all day, or when I have to sit and listen to someone talk. It like mentally exhausts me. Like I think it's the social energy that really gets me. It makes me super tired, but I came home, well, I was getting ready to come home. My husband texted me today. He's like, hey, I think I'm going to go skydiving after work, which he, like, rarely ever does. And he's like, can you bring me my skydiving gear to the airport? Just meet me there. So I went and did that. But because I knew I had so much going on tonight, like I wanted to film this, and I honestly want to edit this, but it's not going to happen tonight. I had so much that I wanted to get done that I went for my run early because it looked like it was supposed to rain this evening. It is yet to rain. I could have definitely ran later and filmed this earlier, but that's okay. Alright, so I'm just going to put some of these date covers down before I flip the page. Gosh, there's like a little gnat in here too. I feel like it's just gross right now. The weather outside has been like muggy and the air feels very thick and just heavy and kind of gross but oh my goodness but I was not I guess I didn't even like go into this I was not able to film a plan with me this evening or this evening that's what I'm doing this weekend because we are going out of town so there's just not going to be enough time to be able, I think I may be able to to edit and upload. I, I wanted to edit tonight, but I think, honestly, I'll have to wait and maybe edit in the car on the way down out of town. But that always makes me really dizzy. I just don't know that I have a lot of options if I want to put out a video, which I do because I've been holding on to this kit and I've been so excited to use it in a plan with me. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, my like phone is just like buzzing like crazy. I'm not used to this at all. But I got home today and I got my Sweet Quite Design Happy Mail and it had my first freebie in it. And it was so cool to actually see it in person. Oh, I'm so thankful for this opportunity. You guys that have been watching me since I started videos, I cannot begin to thank you guys enough for your support because it's because people like you who would comment or like or give me feedback on how to make my videos better that like kept me doing these and then kept me posting in the Sweet Quiet Design Facebook group and then made me really want to do insta stories over the summer like you guys have pushed me outside of my comfort zone and i'm just i'm so grateful for it because this is such a really cool opportunity to be able to be a be on the pr team for sweet quite design one i love i love the company in general i think tasia and Zach do an amazing job at keeping things afloat and like ugh, the quality of everything is fantastic but honestly that's the customer support and the Facebook group that they have is just amazing Let me put this down but I really do I, I know I just put it on insta stories but if you guys use my code which is in the description below and get my freebie in the mail take a picture of it and send it to me please because I had my friend Stephanie send me she sent me a picture of it today and it was just so cool like I don't really know how to describe how I felt about it other than it just it just felt so cool to be able to see that 
And then I caught another post in the Facebook group. Um, I think it was Jennifer that had used my freebie code. So, I w you know, I'm the kind of person who... I'm always so scared that people aren't going to like me or aren't going to like what I'm doing. And, like, it's just... This thing is just so reassuring to see that people got my freebie and are supporting me and the stickers that are on it. And then, of course, like supporting a shop that I genuinely love. I think it's just super cool. But like seeing it all together, it means a lot. Oh, I love these checklists so much. Okay. I need to put those rest of the date covers on and then I'm going to put in the bottom washi and then do my sidebar but I'm going to speed you guys through that because I'm getting quite parched and I don't have water up here so I'm going to stop talking for a little bit speed you guys through and then I will catch back up with you when I get to my actual plans Okay, so there's the general layout. I do want to put in the weekend banner. You can find it here. And it is a straight across style. So Tasia does switch these up quite often with what kind of style she puts in the kits. And I think I want to put it at the bottom this time. Switch it up a bit. It's been quite a while since I've placed it at the bottom, but that's not centered. So hold on, give me one second. Yeah, that's pretty centered. Okay. So yeah, I really like that there. Uh, as long as I don't have like too many bills due, which I didn't even mark down when my bills were due. So let me think real fast. Let's put those down. I do want to use George because there's like a George color in here. I have... Really, just a bill due Thursday. T Thursday. I'm like looking straight at Tuesday and saying Thursday. Okay, I do want to put in my runs. I need four run trackers. So I do think that I want to attempt to color block if I can and have the ability to. So I am going to put down this amazing things are about to happen over here. Let me keep this flipped and I'll zoom you guys in just a little bit. Okay, so let's put that down. And then I don't have any other plans on Monday other than that, so. Actually, I think what I might do again, like I did last week, is I I put down, I need to copy the size of my butt, which I really, I think that might be like my Monday thing.
as of right now, I don't have anything going on that Monday night. But honestly, my schedule is so ever-changing, it's not even funny. Um, Tuesday, I have what a bit going on. So, I want to mark down... I moved my run, but I am going to my dad's... No, we're moving the day that I go to my dad's for dinner. I have an oil change. So let's put that up top. That'll be right after work. I'm gonna get groceries, so let's use a little quarter box there. I think that fixed it for the most part. Let's go on to Wednesday. Um, so I do need to put like a little car there for an oil change, but I'll do all the icons at the end like I did last week. Got my groceries, I've got a whatever I'm doing that night. I've got some stuff on Wednesday that need to go up here, but those are icons. I do want to put down this first day of school sticker from the the back to school what is that? The School Days 2.0. It was like that big package of school stickers. Most of my schools are going back to school on this day, on Wednesday, so I'm going to use this as a back to school. But I was kind of thinking it'd be kind of cool to, to like layer it in one of those half boxes, especially since I have them. Okay, Thursday, I am going to my dad's house that evening. Let me see, I think, I think both of the red ones are unfortunately full boxes and I don't know if I can get two full boxes in this space, but let's try it. Um, I've got this little nerdy Poe looking one and then I've got the It's the Most Wonderful Time of the Year, but I think I really like the nerdy Poe, so. Okay, yeah, I think it looks good. On to Friday. Ooh, actually, I, I forgot to mark it, but I, I do think that it's payday for both of us. Yeah, I didn't write that down, so let's, let's definitely mark payday. Saturday, we have nothing, which is feels awesome. And so I don't really have a full box, but let's put in let's put in a quarter box because if we're in town and we're not doing anything, we'll probably go to the coffee shop. Cuz we used to go every Saturday morning and then we just like fell out of that, but I want I want to make that part of my routine again. And then on to Sunday, uh, again, we don't have anything going on. This weekend's kind of nice. I didn't realize we had an open weekend. There we go. I'll put that all the way at the bottom just so that there's some contrast there. And then 
I can do a half box up here. And then I can put in a cloud there. I really like using the clouds. I don't know if you guys have gathered that from, I don't know, any of my past videos, but the clouds are part of my favorite. Cover up this whiteout. I think I'll like that better. And then I've still got about a space for a quarter box here, so I think I'm just gonna leave that empty. And I can put in, uh, I can put in an icon and write in there if I want to, or I can end up moving some things around a little bit later to make the space work. But. I think we're going to call that part good. I am going to pull out some icons really fast and then go through and add them in. Okay, I finally have all of my icons ready to go. Full disclosure, guys, it's actually the following day, so it is now Thursday. Um, I just didn't have time to finish filming yesterday. It's just been crazy this week. So I am ready to go. I am going to start, but I am going to speed you guys through this, I think, of me just like laying down. But um, I'll be using a few new stickers here and there. Like I do want to put this new little running shoe. It's like itty bitty size up here but then I also want to put in steps underneath it in typography but I, I'm not quite sure what size like I think this smaller size is gonna look better but I mean I'll end up using these at some point I was kinda thinking just like that I mean I think I like it so I'm gonna leave it like that um, but yeah I'm gonna put in the rest of my icons and go from there Okay guys, I think that is it for my week, or at least as far as I can get. But I did, I forgot that I had a dentist appointment on Thursday, so I had to switch some things up there. Um, and then I did go ahead and just use the large laundry typography stickers. I kind of was just feeling like these colors were a little just so, so bright that um, the really big, well they're not big, but the regular size George laundry stickers were just too much with this spread so I dialed that back back a little bit and then the, just did the typography stickers I feel like there's a lot that I'm forgetting or I feel like next week's gonna fill up pretty quickly so uh, that is it though I do love 
how this has turned out, but I am a little sad. I probably should have used this kit this week because I am like four days into the school year of us working and I am just exhausted. <laughs> so next week is going to feel just like, okay, round two kind of deal. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and I hope that you enjoyed. Make sure that you are subscribed to my channel if you want to continue to keep up with what I'm doing. Also, if you want to get notified every time I do put up a new video, hit the little bell. That way it sends you a notification when I put up a new upload. But Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next week. Bye.